Texas Gang Intelligence Database. From the beginning, we have to look at something called records validation, because that could potentially extend the timeline. Information is entered in the Texas Gang Database for a juvenile. A records validation, records review has to be performed after two years. For adults, it has to be performed after five years. What they're gonna be looking at during the validation process are all the records that were collected. Think about documents, photographs, even social media posts or reviewing current social media for the person that's been entered in there. If it's found that the information in the database is no longer relevant, if it's no longer applicable to this person under chapter 67 of the Texas Code of Criminal Procedure, the record gets destroyed. And look, to be clear, it's kind of a, um, a gray area when it comes to the criteria of what's relevant. So there's a lot of judgment calls that are made by law enforcement and the people that are maintaining these databases. If it's found that the information is applicable still, if it is relevant still, then the law enforcement agency that's reviewing the information in the gang database has the ability to keep it in for an additional two years if you're a juvenile or an additional five years if you're an adult.